Who doesn't like free, right? Click on a challenge button and subscribe to my free 30 day real estate investing video challenge. Every day you'll get a video on how I built my business doing nearly a deal per day. It's two and a half hours of industrial strength training. Hey there, Peter Vexelman. So today I want to talk to you, for especially to those of you that are wholesaling deals. And that is, here, here's the question. At what point does it make sense for you to bring a full-time salesperson on board to help you move those deals? And so my contention is this, when you have any kind of consistency with your deals, and when I say consistency, I don't mean like what we're doing here, upwards maybe sometimes as many as 10 deals on a weekly basis. I mean a consistent, predictable, flow of leads coming in or flow of deals coming in, it's time to get a salesperson. So even if you're having one, you know, maybe three or four a month, maybe two or three a month, I think it's time to get a salesperson. And, and here's why. Number one, and when I talk about a salesperson, I mean that is somebody that's gonna take your wholesale deals that you're bringing in and wholesaling them to other investors. And, and, and so the reason I always say you rather hire them or bring them on a little bit earlier than a little bit later is because what they do for you in, in the time they do it, I would contend to say that almost you yourself cannot replicate. Because think about this, your ability to move a deal, a wholesale deal, is pretty much 100% proportional to the size of that investor database. I mean, once the deal's in house, it's all about the, the size of the investor database and it's all about the relationships you built with them. Think about it, if you're at the point where you're working all sides of the equation, you're, you're marketing, you're taking the calls, you're negotiating, you're talking to realtors, you're talking to sellers and all this, that takes a, a quite a bit of time. So you cannot do what that full-time salesperson do, and that is literally 24 seven, worry about doing nothing but developing that investor database. It's critical. The bigger it gets, the more deals you're gonna be able to do. The other thing is why I think it's never really too early to bring one on is because in this industry, we all know that people get paid commissions. So it's not like you're gonna incur a fixed expense. You know, it's not like you're hiring a salesperson that's gonna take 50,000 or $100,000 to keep on board. Now, I think if you pay a salesperson anywhere from 500 to about 1,500, $1,500 per deal, and again, a lot of that depends on the size of the deal, the market you're in, you're fine. But remember, that is a per deal, that is a commission, so that's a variable cost. And, and again, their ability to do nothing but find investors, develop relationship with investors, match up your property, all that does is it frees you, frees you up on this side of the equation. So you can go out there and make more offers. So you can go out there and do more deals. So you can go out there and negotiate and build relationships. So really what happens, the reason I was encouraged to, to focus on, on these salespeople and bring them on, the more you bring on, or the quicker you bring them on, the more time you have here, which means in essence you're bringing more deals on board. So the business starts growing proportionately. So is it ever too early to bring one on? Potentially, if you're just getting started, if you don't have a consistent flow of leads or deals coming in, like I said, at least a couple of months, you're probably not gonna be able to pay or sustain that person. But once you have any kind of consistency, I think one of the first things you need to do is bring on the back-end salesperson to help you develop huge, massive investor databases built relationships with those investor databases and when the, as the properties are coming in as you all know what i preach it's not a matter of selling the deals it's a matter of matching up with the right individuals so it's never too early in my opinion hey you guys know what we do here we do a ton of deals and and i have a one-on-one -on -one coaching program where i coach people just like you to help become very very successful real estate investors so if you're a buyer or you know other buyers literally all over the world that are looking for deals in the Georgia market, specifically concentrated towards Atlanta, you need to be on our buyers list. By now you'll see my email scrolling across the screen. Send me an email, just say add me to the buyers list. And on a daily basis, you're gonna get some terrific both ROI and equity driven deals uh, emailed right directly to you. The other thing, if you're looking to become a successful investor, whether you're brand new, just getting started, or whether you're doing it already and you're looking to be a, a bigger, more sophisticated, more savvy investor, I know I could help you do that. Again, you could either send me an email to learn more about my one-on-one -on -one coaching program, or better yet, right below this video, coachingbypeter.com. You can go straight there and learn more about how I could help you become very successful in this industry.